guys, I'm Brian. Uh, I want to do something today. If you're into aviation and you watch a lot of aviation content, you've no doubt seen these videos where uh, pilots are flying their plane and pouring a bottle of water in, into a glass of water. Um, honestly, I, I don't get it. Um, there's a famous video you can look up of Bob Hoover doing this maneuver, and uh, I, I just I don't understand the popularity or why people are doing this. But, uh, Bob, well, I would give it a shot today. All right, so what I'm going to do is I've got the plane trimmed, straight and level, and uh, so here we go. Now, I just did that. And I guess the difference between me and those other guys is I was able to maintain control of the aircraft during the maneuver. Um, my friend Spencer tried this once, and you can see, as soon as he pours the water, he loses control of the aircraft. Look at him, he's completely inverted. I don't know if it's a trim problem, or if he's just not a very good pilot. I suspect he's probably just not a very good pilot. Every video I watch of him, he's spinning out of control. Um, I was able to do the maneuver while maintaining control of the aircraft and keeping a level attitude. I don't understand why Bob Hoover gets all this credit for being this great pilot when if you watch him pour the tea, you can look, he goes out of control. I don't know why so many pilots do this maneuver and immediately lose control of their aircraft. It's, it's ridiculous. Honestly, I'm surprised Bob Hoover would even upload that video to his YouTube channel. Uh, the FAA watches this stuff. And uh, I don't know, I think loss of control is a major contributing factor to a lot of crashes. And speaking of my friend uh, Spencer, he is, I think, later this month, and I'll overdub the date, on February 17th, 2019. Going to uh, break the record which he currently holds for the most inverted flat spins in a plane. Well, of course it'd be in a plane. What would you invert and flat spin in? Uh, but anyway, he's gonna break that record on the date. February 17th, 2019. And uh, I don't know where he's gonna publish it, but uh, at least somewhere, look, at, look for his channel. This is the first flight of 2019, and it could not be a more beautiful day to fly. It's such a beautiful day to fly. I want to make dorky videos, but it's just gorgeous. Man. I hope everyone's having a great start to their new year, and just, if you're able to fly, you're able to get up and share this with people. And I could not be having more fun, I don't think. Airbag traffic on 73 Bravo is final 17 full stop. Okay, I'm a little bit high, but at least I'm also fast. Final. Oh, this is. I'm going to use the entire runway. <sighs> right, here's where we hit cars at this airport. Wheelie, 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 wheelie. Hold it, 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 hold it. Hold it, hold it. Mm, come on, keep the nose wheel up. There it goes. <laughs> 